General Instructions. Video tutorials opened with 3D PDF Maker will let you go through guided exercises and master the basic and advanced features of the program. All the video material is recorded in high definition, so if the window with the video is enlarged, the resolution will be automatically adjusted in a few moments to offer better visualization. Some video tutorials first offer a descriptive part where you shouldn't do anything but watching and listening. In such videos, your hands-on training starts straight after this descriptive part, clicking on the confirmation button Yes in the automatically open dialog box. You are guided step by step, and at the end of each video passage there is a pause. The video window is minimized to let you decide if to repeat the previous passage or proceed with the next one. All the tutorial files are stored in the 3D PDF Maker tutorial folder, which you can find in Documents in your user folder. To easily find them, go to Libraries, Documents, 3D PDF Maker Tutorial. If you need only tutorial PDF files, you can open them directly from the initial 3D PDF Maker dialog in the Examples pane. At the end of each video tutorial, to close the PDF file and turn back to the initial 3D PDF Maker dialog window, click on the red X box at the top right-hand corner. Let's start right away with a brief exercise and learn to activate 3D model visualization and expand the 3D toolbar in Acrobat Reader. In 3D PDF Maker, in the Examples pane, click on Tutorial and open the file autoyellow.pdf. Click on Show Preview with Adobe Reader. The PDF file is opened in Adobe Reader. If Acrobat Reader hasn't yet been enabled for 3D model activation, clicking on the model area you will see a yellow toolbar prompting to activate the 3D content. Click on Edit, Preferences, 3D and Multimedia and in 3D and Multimedia options, check the box Enable playing of 3D content. Then confirm with OK. From now onwards your Acrobat Reader will be enabled for 3D model visualization. Now click on the 3D model area, then on the icon on the left in the yellow toolbar. The 3D toolbar becomes visible. Click on the downward arrow on the right of the Rotate button, then on Expand 3D Tools. In this way, from now onward, your Acrobat Reader will have all the buttons for 3D model control displayed in the toolbar. Now quit Acrobat Reader, go back to 3D PDF Maker and close the PDF document without saving. It is recommended that you follow video tutorials in the offered order, and soon you will be able to present your 3D models in a stirring, interactive and highly personalized way in PDF documents. At the end of this video, close the tutorial dialog. You will be able to get back to it at any moment by clicking the corresponding button of the toolbar.